Hi, Rich Karuba for BowlingBall.com. You know, we wanted to discuss how to find bowling balls for dry lanes. Because sooner or later you're going to encounter dry lanes, even if the lanes typically are pretty heavily oiled uh, early in the day when you first start at, uh, or competition first begins at your local bowling center, or even if you're in a tournament or you're traveling someplace, sooner or later they're going to break down. The lanes will go away if there's a lot of activity on the lanes, a lot of lineage. And you want to make sure that you have some bowling balls ready to match up. And so you have a lot of wonderful choices. We've got them all available at bowlingball.com. All you got to do is search our site for these bowling balls, latest releases, bowling balls, and you'll see bowling balls for dry lanes. Uh, you can find selections as the, uh, such as the Brunswick Slingshot, which has been a very popular series of balls, of a versatile reactive resin cover stock, works well sanded or polished. That's one smart thing all the manufacturers are doing now, giving cover stock versatility so you can finish it, screen the cover stock yourself, uh, depending on the level of, uh, of friction you need, uh, whether it's a medium dry or very dry lane condition. Uh, now this particular slingshot ball has the largest track flare of any of the balls in its class, so it works good for entry level bowlers looking to move up in class and give a ball that provides hook, but also for competitive players uh, in need of a ball to work on drier lanes. Uh, you can look at the Motive Recon RX-1 Silver Pearl and the Motive Recon RX-1. They're also wonderful choices for, for dry lane conditions. And, uh, the RX-1 uh, has a reaction characteristic of a urethane bowling ball, but with the hitting power of a reactive resin. It's a very good uh, choice of ball. Uh, the MF-300 Smoke Series are good choices for dry lanes because they're three-piece cover stocks, the pancake wake blocks, excuse me, core designs, and they're built in this entry level reactive cover stock which uh, yields two to three inches of flare potential so it gives you the ability to hook a little on the back end but really good skid and uh, length potential on the front end of the lane for those burned up lane conditions. The Tropical Storm series has been a very popular choice for a long time for dry lanes because it has a very highly polished factory finish on a reactive resin cover stock with a modified three-piece core design so the Tropical Storm series are perfect choices for entry-level bowlers or for you tournament bowlers who uh, have maybe a little slower ball speeds or, or for those dry lanes, of course. And finally, the Starburst, the Lane 1 XXL Starburst. Well, that ball's great. It has uh, uh, it's a plastic ball. Uh, it's a great choice for dry lanes. It has low flare potential, making it easy to hold the back ends when they're really hooking, and particularly for senior bowlers or youth bowlers with those slow ball speeds. Uh, it's a two-piece plastic ball made with a quality and designed for use on very, very dry lane conditions. Uh, so those are some good ideas. And also, if you like the novelty balls like the OTB National Hockey League Specialty Bowling Balls, you can get a ball like the OTB NHL Phoenix Coyotes Ball. Uh, it's got the, the logos on the side, uh, the, the mascot on one side, the logo on the other. Uh, it's a very eye-catchy ball with a high gloss factory finish. Works well in those dry lane conditions or for spare shooting. Uh, so if you're looking to improve your game, uh, consider, and you're going to encounter these drier lane conditions, consider one of those choices. We think it'll help you. Uh, there's an article about it on our website. Uh, and if you have any questions, just send us a little blog and we'll be happy to get back with you. Anyway, thank you for your time and uh, we hope these tips help.